Hey guys, welcome to another video for SimonsVideo.com and my name is Simon Tay and uh, today I'm going to do an uh, update to my modification of my Airwheel LED and as you can see from here, uh, it doesn't seem to be any different from the previous but I have created some modification uh, and I created a, uh, I would say, I stick on a larger battery that can last a longer time I have a uh, two output from the battery which the store from Simlim Tower uh, very generously helped uh, solder it to two output and the switch is over here um, let me focus it yep the switch is over here and the front LED is the same as the previous white LED and as you have noticed there is a blue LED at the bottom uh, I stick it right at the bottom so when I switch it on it is blue in color and there is a wire over here that is very inconspicuous uh, that it traveled from over here to under padding to over here to another LED over here which is red in color which is awesome and there you go this is the latest update Okay, before you go down to Simim Tower Basement 1-12 uh, to get your LEDs uh, you know, uh, the next day, make sure you measure your air wheel, the left, the right, the top and bottom, everything you need to measure, measure it. You may not know the length of the wire required in between the LEDs when the shopkeeper actually asks you for estimation. So either you measure it properly or you bring your air wheel to the shop uh, so that they can measure it on site. Um, they will not stick the, you know, the LEDs for you onto the air wheel because there are some other modification like the paddings and all that you need to uh, think in advance before you go to the shop. Right, so the best way is to bring your air wheel to the shop, uh, you know, to give them the best measurement. Uh, the reason why is because, um, you know, uh, I have some wires that are a, a little bit too short. I have to extend it manually by myself, although I have the experience, but uh, it's not the best way because it's a fire hazard. You know, if you have a um, wires that short circuit it may cause fire hazards so do not uh, do it yourself if you have no experience at all in the wiring of the LEDs right uh, the shopkeeper will actually help you to sold up the wires and uh, insulate it properly uh, from uh, short circuits right so the LEDs uh, try to choose the battery that can last up to six hours um, that means the, the shopkeeper will actually ask you how many LEDs you need and you'll calculate how long that particular battery can last if you turn it all on at the same time another update uh, that i'd like to uh, mention is the laser light leds which i've actually removed due to damage uh, due uh, by mishandling it i actually push the laser light led upwards and while it's firmly secured to the handle of the air wheel and it actually broke off relatively easy so unfortunately i uh, unable to repair it so uh, i've thought of the you know replacing it using this red led lights uh instead so i might put it back in the future but uh, in the meantime it's not cost effective right now to actually buy a new one or get a new connector because it's a uh, very specific to uh you know the bicycle handle or the bicycle uh, the the back of the bicycle so I might not uh, replace it but using this red LED lights is actually sufficient for me uh, one thing I'd like to thank Jameson Chin uh, one of my airwheel friends to come down at early in the morning at 2 a.m. to help film this video and uh, of course uh, we actually traveled to McDonald at the Bukit Batok uh, Central and come back for a nice uh, Dechu Bay uh, uh, Dechu porridge supper which is awesome and after that we filmed this awesome uh, video around the neighborhoods 
and uh, it's very very nice uh, you notice that I've added the additional uh, white LED strip on the top side that is uh, using an additional battery uh, of my previous uh, upgrade so I actually uh, place it on the top that means I have two batteries uh, external for LEDs I can turn on uh, the white lights only that will show the down uh, bottom side to show the Halloween uh, version of the LEDs which is awesome <laughs> well basically that's it for this video thank you very much for watching Simon's video have a nice day see ya bye